Welcome to Space Race. Uh, in the previous episode we have successfully landed the man on the moon. Venusian weather report. We should do the launch preparations. This is an uncrewed mission. Good enough. Well, the launch reliability is crap, so we're going to do the launch reliability training. And launch date we're going to set to reap the maximum possible rewards. 12, 15. So, that's that. When it comes to research, we have now reduced a vehicle cost research for the 50% off. So I might actually go crazy on the upper stage, 65%, 80%. What's the cost? 425, 637, Saturn 1B. I might go with one boosters because I'm thinking if I go with one boosters, I'll, I'll unlock the next tier of vehicles. Yeah, so I'm gonna go with those and then I'm gonna go with these. Alright. So, what do we have for missions venus venusian weather that's we have a plan for that endurance test lightning survey what is this auxiliary propulsion system half a chance of a critical event during launch not bad i'm looking for lucrative missions come on Lunar radiation, none? Seriously? Atmospheric sensors. So this one is 3000. And this one is 4.8 thousand. And lightning survey. Half the chance of critical event during the launch. This is 3.10 as well. Finish third or above in three milestone missions. Do we have milestones? Third or above. What do we have any milestones here? Milestones. Do we have any milestones here? This was the second one. Do we have any milestones here available? Mars orbit. No. All right. Then we go for the Skylab and we're going to go. Is anybody else going for the space station? Let's just quickly check. Space station, I thought as much. Vesta. None. None. Yes, they are researching the station. But they'll need a vehicle to launch it, so yeah. Okay, let's do the research now. I was thinking, while well, I have the 50% off, which one I want to do? Centaur D, Athena, Atlas. What's the max? These are outer planets. That's the booster, right? Yeah. So Athena is outer planets and this is outer planets. Build time four months. I'm thinking I'm gonna go with Athena. And then I'll have to check out the booster, so. Yeah. Athena. Solid fuel upper stage and I'm thinking. So Atlas 3 or Delta 4. 80 plus 1. 65 plus 2. Or Titan 50 plus 6. 
Titan is doesn't look too bad. It's a lot cheaper than Delta. Capacity 16,000, 24,000. I'd rather research Delta and then Titan, perhaps. Now, what's the research cost? Thousand. In both cases. So 50%, 80%. I'm going to go with Delta on this one. Delta 4. Okay, rendezvous attempt. Only because upper stage reliability counts. So, oh design. Marmaduke. Looks wonderful. Four months build time. Upgrade. Vehicle construction costs further down or reinforced tank walls. I mean, why not? Contractor. You will be giving us... Are you giving us some science? Yes, you are. Select contractor. Sure. Build a vehicle. And then when it comes to research, we no longer have the research benefits. So we might want to continue with the Skylab, actually. Okay, hold on. Earth. Long duration flight. 20 chance of positive event. A beefy science amount. We have the cash for it. We might. So, do we want to put an extra crew? Why not? Okay, the payload is built. We have three active missions. That's something that always bugs me. The notion weather report though comes up out in two months. So by then Marmaduke will be complete. All right. Earth. Earth topography. Nope. Not interested. Skylab is almost done. Venusian weather report. Let's set the launch. The weather looks certainly nice. Batang. 1971. Excellent conditions. Beautiful. Hit it. Five, four, three, two, one. We have liftoff. Up it, up it goes. So how was our launch? Secure launch, no mission effects. Both are level five now, so it's a good reliability. Wonderful. Venusian weather report, you're being launched. Okay, we need to do eight thrusts. So, or actually eight and 15 thrust. And to generate 15 thrust, we need to hit this at least four times. And one of it needs to be turned before. It's a very specific. Okay, so four times. If I hit it four times, that will generate four. And I have to generate four nav. Eight. Four nav. Let me think about it. I have to generate four nav followed by eight data followed by four comms. And it has to be done before two turns remaining. Right. So what can we do first? We could actually take first care of 
what will give us me the highest yield. If I first do data, data alone will give me nothing. So I need comms and so comms and uh, comms and nav will give me data. So that puts me two comms to four. That's good enough in my book. There we go. All right, now we have, I think this is actually, we should do a rinse repeat because two, four, four, eight, yes. We have the the kicker is do we have enough for it so if i do uh so i need to be making i need to end with four and this and some of the comms at least So one this and one this gives me five comms. So these two give me an additional four data. Yes. I have to get up this guy and I have to take up this guy. Yeah, this is where we need to end up. Hopefully none of them fails because we have to throw in a recharge in there somewhere. I'll just resist. There we go. So in this turn we should do one burn. And that puts us five three and six ideal and i'm gonna hit two recharges because then in the next turn i hit this once then we'll have six and uh, yeah i think we'll be we'll be okay All right, now we should hit one, two, three. Eight, fifteen, and three to spare is pretty much a guaranteed kill. Not that we needed it. And there's how it's done. Venus transfer trajectory. We shall be getting 350 for four months. Beautiful. Almost done with Skylab. Funding review due next month. Budget review. Come on, give me some. Okay, we didn't hit the next year, but it's still nice. Skylab research complete. An orbital space station capable of housing multiple crew and equipped with vi wide variety of scientific instruments. Yes. Now, do we have do we have what it takes to actually do this? Milestones. Space station. Suggested vehicle parts. I need to get shuttle pronto. Right. Research wise vehicles that tells me i have to re research the titan first okay so earth milestones space station no mission slots available oops okay is anything gonna go soon 
completes in one month. Venusian weather report that's already on route. Completes in three months, completes in one month. Okay. Fair enough. Is there a lucrative mission lurking? There it is. Okay. Next month we're going to get rid of one of them anyway. Next, design a vehicle. Reuse a design. Marmaduke. Looks good to me. Load the design. Upgrade. Reinforced tank walls. I don't see why not. Contractor. Keller Industrial Infinity Orbitals. We're gonna get more support. Or we're gonna get more science. Yes, more science. Definitely. A little bit longer to build. I'll live with that. Alright. So, Titan will be researched. And now we're gonna be researching the thing that we need. The oh, crap. We still need to get to the shuttle. Dang it. Let's go research the SRBs. This will be the quickest way forward. Venusian weather report coming in one month and then the Marmadukes will be done. So we can do the lucrative mission, hopefully. Next mission phase ready. Plus 10 or mission training bonus reduced. Well, I guess I'll just have to live with this. So, rendezvous attempt. Who I don't want to take to on the rendezvous. On the rendezvous attempt... I'm definitely taking the electrician. Al dente. And I'm taking now... I'm taking the scientist. So, rule on Powelson. It's you. You're up. Training. I think science should be the training de jour. And we're gonna set July. I do want to launch launch sooner rather than later, but we still have some research to do, so we're fine. Alright. What? Active missions, Venusian weather report. Oh, we are ready to continue. Phase ready. And we have the heat mechanic, obviously. So. We need to be kept below three. And we need seven, seven, eighteen Gs. So, I'll need you, followed by you. And I don't have enough heat to take this one down. Okay. Should I be hitting this again? Or rather... this one maybe of course you wanted to resist there we go system check okay now we're extra crispy so we're gonna have to hit this guy to bring the heat down Then I really need to hit this guy to get that high up. And I'll hit one recharge just to be on the safe side. There we go. System check heat. We're still extra crispy. So I can hit this guy to reduce the heat. This guy to significantly up this and another recharge wouldn't hurt. 
I think that's the way we climb up, I, I guess. Of course I need to resist. You're giving me one data. Yeah, I need more data. All right, now we are at two heat. Hmm, <clears throat> so we don't need to hit this guy yet. And in the next turn we won't care. So... I'll hit this. I'll hit this once. And then I need something. I'll need a recharge again. Please don't break. Of course it broke. It will take one more comms. You know what? Whatever. Okay, so now if I press this guy I mean, we don't care about the heat this check. Hold on. We don't care about the heat here. So all we want to do is get this 3-3. Three, three. So 3-3. Three, three. So one date and this gives me 5. And then something which gives me Poof. and I need something that gives me one extra data. Nope. So we have one extra of these. This is nine six six twenty and then no I have to figure out a way how to actually tackle this one. Okay, this one would reduce and now I have to increase the recoms. I should re bring one nav, one na nav and three comms. Three comms is this, five comms, three nav and three comms but that reduces me back to square one. And then I just use this one for the maximum and hope everything will be hunky-dory. Of course it won't be. And then if I accept this, it's one less. <laughs> won't be the 50% bonus reward. Still good enough. Yeah, I'll take what I can get. Now what? Request broadcast satellite. Ooh, lucrative. Perfect. Challenging. And we get advanced shock absorption. I'm planning that one already. All right, commercial satellite, definitely. Select the payload. Build the payload. Go to solar system. And I'm guessing I have no more active missions. Yes, alright. Next month. XXRB's research complete. And now I want to be researching the space shuttle. There we go. So with that thing out of the way. Enterprise dominates, Earthrise dominates papers. A striking Earthrise photograph taken by the moon's surface by astronaut Rulon Powelson has drawn claim for countless news outlets. 
Beautiful. So, this month we are launching the rendezvous attempt. Uh, reliability, I would say, is pretty decent across the board. The weather seems to be doing okay. Ideal for launch of this magnitude. Adequate conditions. Do it. Five, four, three, two, one. We have lift off. We have lift off. And away it goes. No mission effect. Atlas and Agena both sitting comfortably. Alright. Now rendezvous attempt. Achieve Earth orbit first. And we have again the drift here. 14, 14, 14. Beautiful. Okay, so. I'm definitely planning to use the crew. We have two crew. Okay, the two of you have done this. Now, these together should give me four nav. And then a little bit power, and this should give me three, three, four. Oh, wait, wait, wait. And I could do one more. Even so. Three, three, four. Oh, what could I do to increase the rest of them? So if I take this, I'm gonna upping these two. Well, if I take this, yeah, I could take this and then flip them on this side. Yeah, sure. There we go. Amazing. Now we take the two of you followed by a drift compensator and then another drift compensator. Six, seven, eight with four power to boot. With four turns remaining. I'm always worried if I should be doing more on this side. Three and two. Maybe this could be another clue furthermore. Yeah, I'm gonna go with these. Obviously. Something needed to be resolved. Okay. I'm gonna resist it. There we go. 10 10. Now we go. with this guy followed by this twice and then a recharge and then we'll need to hit hard on the other part yeah there we go Alright, so now we have excess data. We should put it to good use. So, 9, 14, 12. With this going 13, 14, 12. So, 1, no, like 14, 13, 14. I'm going to go with this. 
I think we're gonna go for that bonus reward. And now I just need one data. Let's power in this guy and recharge. Perfect. All right. Perform controlled re-entry. Now we have the eating mechanic. 614. That's 1228. Jeez, that's a lot. Okay, so we don't we should keep below three. Now it's at two. And we need to have extra resource. So the two of you will give me four of these. Which is nice. I'm not complaining. And you shall give me two of these, hopefully. And what shall give me the data then? Yeah, I could have really used another crew member here. That would have been very nice. Yeah. And what not? Like this, perhaps? I don't know. Oh, you are doing extra. Thank you. An additional data. Wonderful. Space check heat. Now it's going to get extra crispy. Now the two of you will be hitting this hard. And the two of you will be hitting the comms hard. So seven, nine... What could produce more? You could do this and then followed by this, hopefully. Mm -hmm. Resisting, I get four versus three, I'll live. All right, system check heat, plus two. Now, in the next turn we'll be hitting the heat, so we'll be upping this by four. So I want to take this guy. Then I want to be taking this guy. That's a thirteen fifteen. I want to be taking this guy and I want to be taking a recharge. Let's hope that this will suffice. System check heat. Now you'll get extra crispy. Right, so we hit you for 21 shot. And then what generates the most? And it's not this one, everybody generates two. But you're generating this. And then you're generating this as well. And then you should be adding one more towards everything. Of course you farted. I knew you would. It would take one more comms. Do it. Comms are not that hard to come by and it's the nav that I cannot afford risking. Okay. So this is the last turn. I basically do this and we're good to go. That's it. I can hit four recharges and I'm be none the wiser. Of course you needed to fart, but I don't care. 
capsule returns home. We'll skip on the boats though. We're going to get 443 and getting some more experience, of course. Aldente and Rulon, you're going for a well deserved rest. Space shuttle being complete. And I'm thinking if we did this one now, we have the Mars lucrative one also to do. Plan mission, yes, we could use some cash. So, Mariner 1, 400, Mariner 8, would be more than capable. Yeah. All right, build a payload. Next month. Long duration flight, vehicle complete. Okay, uh, we have three spaces. I actually am not sure if I want to have What's the payout? It's good amount of science. 81 reliability, vehicle 83 reliability, that's good enough. I'm thinking I want to, when it comes to crew, I want to hire. So if I have three, let's go and crew wise, what, who can we hire? We have a oh, problem solver, minus one, Random resource requirement per task. Celebrity navigator. Plus 10 science reward upon mission success. Mm. I'm just thinking. What should we take? I'm thinking probably Navigator wouldn't be a bad idea. Scientist. I'm going to rename you Bryden Lang to... Uh, the next one on my list is Jackson Branson. Congratulations, you have been hired as a navigator and active missions so what does the mission require payload vehicle launch preparations all right so i will be taking the test pilot The navigator, Jackson Francine, and the comm specialist. See how that works. Mission training should be science. And launch date, September, I guess, unless the weather messes up. When it comes to the lucrative mission, oh, we already have a plan and Likewise for the other one. Venus. What do you have? Venusian weather report. Oh, look at that. Now we're getting some lucrative missions. That's nice. Okay. Broadcast satellite. Payload complete. Long duration flight. Launch the mission. And it's raining. We're going to reschedule until January for the maximum bonus. Broadcast satellite. Let's design a vehicle. Reuse the design. Marmaduke seems simple enough. Good reliability too. Atlas and Agena upgrade. I'd still go with reinforced tank walls, maybe composite casing. 
everything to boost its launch reliability. What can we do? Contractor X star avionics. So four months to two months. You're increasing this. You're upping the research. Yeah, it's, it's a lucrative mission. So whatever we can do, we can do to reduce the cost. Yeah, you could reduce the cost at the expense of support, which we're not going to get anyway. I like that. Confirm. Build a vehicle. All right. I'm guessing this might be our final month that we will take before we wrap for the episode. Vehicle booster gains three experience levels after launch. That would be awesome if we could get a good booster. So let's see. Design new. Upper stage. What's the reliability? 71, 71. 36 and booster which one which booster do we want to titan 3 might not be a bad idea and we don't need additional boosters for it we could use titan 3 sure and upgrade Reinforced tank walls, yes, and contractor Eleanor Industrial. There we go. I want the booster to get three extra levels. All right, that being said, I think we have come to the end of the episode. So, in the next one, we will be launching all these wonderful flights. But that will happen in the next one and we'll have our space shuttle done in the next one. So thank you very much for watching. Like if you liked the episode and I'll see you all in the next one. This is Gromfrex signing off.